Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a Shop Miss A haul and I have this huge box here. It's actually like stuffed to the brim. This actually wasn't supposed to come until like Thursday. It came today and I was happy for it, but at the same time I wasn't prepared. I didn't get it until it was dark outside. The lighting isn't really good when it's dark outside, so that's why we're in this different kind of setup. I'm in like a different angle. Like normally I'm like angled that way if I'm in here and that's really chill. I don't want this to be a chill video. I want this to be a nice video, if that makes sense. I tried to set it up like literally for an hour probably trying to get good lighting and not looking too unnatural i do have this overhead light on and i just don't like how unnatural it looks with just this light because it's like literally dark everywhere but here and then i can't see anything and then i'm literally blinded because that's the only source of light i really want to get like a actual ring light for christmas this is just like a ring light that you put on like an iPhone for like selfies and stuff. So I want to get an actual ring light because I feel like it actually lights up more of a space and not just my face. So yeah, I'm super excited because I have so many Christmas gifts in here. Like there's multiples of pretty much everything in here. And there's some products that I just really wanted to try out. I'm just really excited because I want to go ahead and put my gifts together because I just love Christmas. These are my favorites. So I would get like four and five of all of my favorites. Some things I needed to restock on. I hope y'all enjoy the video and let's just get started. There's a bunch of stuff. I'm gonna show everything and if you're my friend and you see something you might get it i don't know i got four of these wonder blenders because i got them for like all my friends and then i wanted to try one a few days ago they came out with like new ones like the softer one and this doesn't feel as soft not like two different it said there's inconsistencies in them which makes me so sad and i did not know that i think i'm gonna go wet this one to see if it's like is soft like the other one because i'll be so sad if it's not i was so excited for these sponges because i love this one and i use it all the time maybe i just need to wash it because it feels like there's so much water in this i feel like that one did it before i broke it and maybe but it's so hard. I really hope that these aren't like that because I don't want to give my friends hard sponges. Look, I got a fifth one. That's great. I got another one. Are you serious? That's a great start to things. I got four of these scrubby facial cleansing pads and I love this thing so much. Don't mind my nails. They look so bad. I love this thing so much. I use it to take off face mask. I use it to just wash my face with regular cleanser. I know that I love these pure cotton squares, so... I got five of them for my friends and then for me. Let's just throw these back here. That's fun. I'm so sad that those sponges are like that. Why did I buy six of them? Oh, wow, that's so fun. <laughs> I just got one of the cotton rounds just because I was like, might as well. And then I have this bag of makeup. And then I got five Love You canvas bags. Wow, these are long. I'm pretty sure Amelia was the shorter version. There's those. <laughs> I just thought that that was going to be like a more dramatic pair of Luella and I feel like Luella has gotten longer as well and it's pretty natural. We shall see. I also got two of 43s because I remember like I got these ones when I first started out with lashes. This is how I started out with lashes was these kind, these Cara ones. I would learn how to do it but then I went through those because I was learning how to do it. I want to see how these actually look applied well i got the six pack of alexis lashes i love these lashes even though they are inconsistent but i thought since these were in a pack like at least i can like look and like match up the ones that are consistent if you can just look at that for like a second or two you can just pick it out this is cute though i like how they started doing six packs then i got uh the aoe studio scissor tweezers because i feel like you can never have too many tweezers plus i have some scissor tweezers I don't know what they're from but at least like this brand i'll know where they're from i just love these kind of tweezers this is where I apply my lashes with and what I pluck my eyebrows with. And I got this bandana headband, like not a bandana, like it's a actual cute headband cross. It like does the little nice, what do, you, what do you call that? Like, I don't know. I don't know how I'm gonna wear this cause I feel like I don't look good on headbands. Yeah, so we're gonna have to figure that out. And then I got my two favorite brush sets. Let's just go in with this first little package of goodies. I love how they put it in like little packages because it's just like extra protection. This is so tiny. These are so little and cute. These are big for like an eyeshadow and highlighter. But I got this highlighter as an eyeshadow. I didn't want this color like as a highlighter. I wanted it as an eyeshadow. I got this perfect setting powder in almond to try as a bronzer. I got another of those eyeshadows. Finally, we're to the fun part of the video where we can swatch some makeup. This is the OA studio velour eyeshadow this is what the outer packaging looks like here's the shadow whoa so i did like a little side swatch to where like it's not as pigmented but it is pigmented normally whenever you do like a swatch like this it's less pigmented if you know what i'm saying it's such a pretty color this shade is express this is the velour highlighter in circus see those like purple reflex but it has like purple and blue and yellow whoa you see that that literally is so soft okay so that's very crumbly once you rub it in 
I don't think it's doing it justice, but there's literally purple and blue. It's gonna be so pretty on the eyes. This one is the last one I have. This is in Lucky Star, and I just love this color. Oh, wow. They're like all kind of a different texture, but this one is like super pigmented. Look at that. This one is so foiled. Oh my goodness. There you go. I'm gonna re-swatch those shades so you can see it. I'm gonna be swatching accurately in here. I can't get over how crumbly this highlighter is. But like, it's literally crumbles on my head. Oh my goodness. It just get prettier every time. Okay, I still feel like it's not showing up as like majestic as it is on my hand okay i literally get so excited about makeup you don't even understand people watch this video that aren't like makeup obsessors and be like what in the world why is she getting so excited and that one's express i love how tiny this is wow i love new makeup and i really hope this lighting is okay i hope you like this setup and i like how i'm like throwing it on the bed because it does make it feel like a chiller video but i so I want it to feel good quality, if you know what I'm saying. This AOA Studio Perfect Blush. This is in Wispy. Whenever they would swatch it, they would press it in, but it's just like a normal powder blush, so I don't know when they were going. And they released more colors literally whenever I had placed the order. It's actually not that pigmented, which I don't mind. This kind of looks like my Sunsets Blush by Amuse, I think. This is less intense. I don't know. I don't feel like that was what it looked like on the website, but like I really want the shade Mod because it's like literally just like a perfect nude really cool tone pink so i didn't really want to try out the perfect setting powders just because i really like loose powder and i don't want to change it up if you're new to my channel the aoa studio perfect setting powder in soft light is literally the best setting powder ever it literally makes your skin look so natural i'll link my shaman say favorites up here and that's going to be like all the products that i had before this this is the aoa studio perfect finishing pressed powder and this one is in almond this is so creamy it I'm confused. <laughs> there it is on like the palest part. I feel like it will look a lot better like on the face. Darker. Actually like a bronzer, hopefully. Now to this bag of goodies. Yes. I'm pretty sure this is like the last duplicate I have. And it's actually a lot smaller than I thought. For some reason, I thought these were gonna be huge. Gary Studio Oh Honey nourishing lip oils this is like actually the honey one i think these are the last face products before i ordered they came out with these this is the aoa studio hush cream sheer blush and this one is in cozy whoa they're probably the exact same color i wasn't gonna get one of these highlighters but i just really wanted to try it out and this was the only one that seemed like a smidge natural like they all have like a very strong like duochrome finish this is the duo cream highlighter in dream whoa look you see that it's literally liquid that's definitely not what the swatch looked like because a strong pinky yellow reflect it smells like a pool now i'm gonna do the three eye products and then finish off with the lips they're all the same just different colors that's how i am with everything aoa studio starlight liquid eyeliners here is the packaging it is a little sheerer than i thought and there's hollywood this one is in superstar these aren't as whatever i thought they were gonna be this one is paparazzi like give it a bit of a doubt i feel like these were gonna be so much more liquidy i feel like this stopper is stopping it so much if the stopper wasn't there a lot more product would come out there the three me my hand kind of feels stiff and i feel like it's gonna crack now for the lips i have these lip pops which i was so excited about i got this aoa studio wonder matte liquid lipstick and hype they've changed the smell but it's not good Ooh, this is pretty i've just been looking for like a perfect nude and i feel like this is so pretty a lot of nudes they're too nude or they're brown the old scent was like kind of trying to be cherry which was fine with me now it's kind of like paint mixed with licorice so that's that and i love it it's like a mauvey nude i went through these so many times because like i just want to buy all of them these are the three colors i got kind of look the same kind of don't this is role model starlet and city girl they're so cute so you can actually squeeze it out it doesn't really have a smell this one is role model and this is like a peachy one i feel like there's a lot of air in the bottle this one is starlit which is the more mauvey that's so pretty role model is a lot more pigmented this one is pretty sheer this one is city girl see i'm really bad when i roll it it's kind of in the middle and it's brown which it wasn't on the website but it's fine here they are in this lighting i think i want to put on starlit it smells like a treadmill that's what it smells like but now that it's on my lips it feels so good it doesn't even feel like i'm wearing a gloss like it's not goopy at all but it feels just like a lip balm i kind of wish this was as liquidy as the highlighter was so i'm gonna take it and put it like on my fingers and then i'm gonna put this on the 
That's what I really wanted it for, was like inner corner. That just looks so cool. Like that's gonna look so cool with just like no makeup on. Wow, your makeup looks so cool, bro. Thanks, it took me like two seconds, bro. I literally almost slipped off a stool and I would have busted my butt. Since we're just putting everything on our pets tonight, now I might as well put this on. So now that I've literally made myself look like a crazy person, I'm gonna go ahead and go. I'm gonna clean all this mess up. Sorry if some parts seemed a little negative. It was just, I was very surprised that this is really hard, that they hadn't like addressed their inconsistencies. I really hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, I would love it if you subscribe down below. Please give this video a big thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching. Bye. So here's the aftermath, yes. Also all of this goodness.